Hello everyone. In this lecture, we will discuss how to add a balloon to a component. To add a balloon, you need to use the balloon tool. The balloon we add to the footprint will have atom number into it. Now, let us see how to insert a balloon. For that, make sure that you are in the panel tab and then in this insert component footprints panel, you need to choose this balloon tool. On choosing this tool, you can see you are prompted to select component for balloon. Suppose I am selecting this first component. Now, it is asking me to specify the leader start or you can say balloon insertion point. Means if you want a leader and then a balloon, then you can just specify the leader or you can just click over here and then press enter so that balloon will be inserted without leader now if i want to have here you can see the snaps are on if i want to make it off i can do that now what i will do i will just specify the leader start then to point like this and now here i can press enter so that balloon will be inserted you can see now the balloon is inserted over here now if i want to have balloon without a leader then i can do it for this component suppose I am selecting this component but here you can see the message box is displayed where it is written that the balloon was unable to be inserted because catalog information is missing for this component so you need to first assign the catalog information and then try inserting the balloon again okay so in that case I can just go back means I have pressed escape and now I will choose the edit tool and I can select this component and I can assign the catalog information using the catalog lookup button here I need to assign the lookup table I will assign PB now I will choose OK here in the catalog browser dialog box let me erase the content in the search field and I can choose search now and here I will now select one push button switch and I will just choose the OK button now you can see the catalog information is added now here I can add item number also suppose I am putting the item number as 251 now I will choose the OK button now panel footprint update message box display no. it is saying that AutoCAD electrical cannot find a footprint lookup table for this manufacturer code so do you manually force a footprint change if you want a footprint change you can choose yes or otherwise you can choose no leave, leave as is now if I choose the yes change it now I can just go and change it manually we have discussed about this footprint dialog box in one of our previous lectures so you can just use it to change the catalog information or you can manually put the footprint. Right now I will just choose the cancel button because our main aim in this lecture is to insert balloon. Now I will just choose the balloon tool again and let us try inserting balloon to this footprint again. I will again make the snap off and now here I don't want leader for this balloon so I will just press enter so you can see now the balloon is inserted here without the leader now before inserting balloon to another footprint I would like to choose edit tool and suppose I am selecting this footprint and let me just remove the item number let us see now I will choose the ok button now if I try to insert balloon to this footprint you can see now let me choose this again to turn off the snap and now I will just specify the leader start and end point and I will press enter you can see now no item number match for this catalog part number is written over here now you can specify the item number over here means if you are trying to insert balloon for a component which has a catalog information but 
does not have item number then this dialog box will be displayed and here you need to specify the item number either in this edit box or you can just go to this list buttons to get the item numbers or other footprints in the active drawing and you can get the list of item numbers present in all the drawings in the project suppose i am choosing this you can just see item numbers in use project wide is displayed and if i am choosing this list button then item numbers in use drawing only is displayed so i can use this list to get the item number or i can use next button to get the next item number suppose i want this 151 again as item number i can choose the okay button now it has just displayed the item number in a balloon now let us check one more case for inserting balloon now if i am choosing the balloon tool again and this time i am selecting a footprint where already balloon is inserted then let us see what happens in that case it is written in this message box and this existing item balloon message box that this component already has a balloon attached do you want to delete existing and insert a new balloon then you can choose the okay button if you want to have balloon with leader you can just do so otherwise you need to choose the cancel button so this is how you can insert balloons to the footprint so that is all in this lecture in the next lecture we will discuss how to insert multiple balloons to a footprint so thank you guys for watching